bitch me folded. You never that boy. Can't lead a kill without the drugs and the cap. Nah. If I went in some neck, baby. Yeah, that's on my back, boy. Get ear to the max, boy. Finny, that's a fat boy. I'm from a place where it's dark outside. The late nights you can't walk outside. Got the names on them. Hit you when your homeboys ride. As your mom shed a tears and she wondering why. Uptown double H. Man, it's beautiful. Five, MP in the cut, what? yeah, we get it live. Hey, most can't go to any hood, but it's connect some could, baby, some hella good, baby. Okay, hey, Fab MP, where I used to be. Uh -huh. Page Street, we was right next to JP. Yeah. Hot box, not the Pontiac, talk, couldn't see. And it's like that we live, man, it's full of sin. So we cope with the pain, bottle with a gin. Hey, New York, brim, fresh cornbread, Tim. Dice games on the corner, can't play if your pocket slim. Hey, can't play, boy, never him. And don't play the game if you ain't trying to win. Hey, I'm just trying to change my L's to 100 wins. Hey, big dubs, you feel me? Yeah. Hey guys, I haven't done a vlog in like forever. I'm chilling with the two grandsons in the back. Goes JJ, and there goes Pinky. So I actually had all four of them last night, but the two youngest ones. So we are on our way to go to where? Madonna. Go to Dunkin' Donuts and Dunkin' Donuts. Okay. This is my morning. I, I should go to the Dollar Tree with them. Yeah, we're on our way to Dunkin' Donuts. Cause you know I have to have duties every morning. I'll have pancake with me because I got them too. And they are not, okay? Had the baby last night, so cute. And then my little two-year-old grandson was just 10 o'clock in the morning. And I like to really go to the store early. But normally I'm outside at the stores by like 8.30 cause that's when I drop Pinky off to school. But it's just afternoon, so 10 o'clock is good. Today I got the boys, you know, so they're going to make sure that I'm okay. They might not, they might drive me crazy. Y'all want McDonald's breakfast, right? Yeah, I want McDonald's breakfast. 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 They don't have fries. You can't have fries and hash browns. Three hash browns. What you want, JJ? Uh, we're going to be driving, so can't eat pancakes while we're driving. You can't eat pancakes while we're driving. You want a wrap and, and two hash browns? A wrap and two hash browns. And y'all both want oranges? Okay. Two burritos and a hash brown. And two small orange juices. What about apple juice or something? Okay, two of those. Let's try one of these breakfast burritos. You guys, I never had this, JJ. I hope it don't make my stomach hurt. Nate said they taste good, though. You can have mine, too. Why? I don't like them. I want them. This is nasty. Maybe if I put, like, something on it. Hmm. And he gave me hot sauce, but I think you need the sauce on it. Because if, if you don't put the sauce on it, it's not going to taste good. Here, let me see it. The picante sauce, whatever this is he put in there, he's like, I put hot sauce in. Like, okay, dude. Mm -hmm. Don't keep none of this on the car, because Aunt May will be pissed off. Let's go to Dunkin' Donuts. All right, so we got to go to the store and get some toilet paper. Food city? No, not the Food City. To, like, just to get some toilet paper. I was probably going to go, let's go to the Tyler General. I don't feel like going. Oh, should I go in the grocery store? I'm trying to think. If I go in the grocery store, I can get me some wine. But then drinking wine makes me tired. And I don't want to be tired like that. So, I'm trying to think what I need from the grocery store. Like, I did want to go to the Dollar Tree, but for what? I don't need anything from the Dollar Tree. Go to Walmart. Dollar General had barely any toilet paper. I mean, they did, but I'm not going to pay six dollars seven dollars for um eight rolls of toilet tissue because i would have had to buy two packs of the scott 
and it wouldn't even have been a Scott's brand. It would have been the Dollar General brand, which is comparison to Scott's. You know, I love Scott's brand. I grew up on Scott's, so that's what I like. I'm not really like a Charmin person or that Cottonelle. I don't really like that sort of thing too much because, for one, you don't get enough on a roll. And I'm not in the process. I'm not in the business of just keep constantly buying toilet paper over and over again. So I just don't really like Cottonelle, and I don't like um, the other ones. Uh, whatever Charmin. So I could just go to Walmart and um, get um, 20 rolls of Scott's name brand for nine dollars. I just didn't feel like going to Walmart because you know, not, it's not even the COVID because I don't, you know, I don't even know what to believe about that. But I just, you know, it's the weekend and everybody want to be in Walmart and I'm kind of like not in the mood to be in Walmart, but the Dollar Tree is next door. But I don't even want to go there because I don't want to spend my money on things that I don't need. I'm trying so hard to think, what do I need from the Dollar Tree that I could just wander in there? Whatever I need from the Dollar Tree, I'm pretty sure I can get from Walmart. Okay, when we get in here, y'all better act right. Don't don't let me have to um hem somebody up by the, by the straps, because I would hate to do that. I would not want to embarrass you guys up in here, because I don't like being embarrassed. So, behave. Y'all hear me? I can't hear you guys. Okay. Remember how I told you guys? Remember how I told you guys I was coming here for toilet paper, and then I was gonna go to Dollar Tree, right? Well, I seen. Well, I seen all these people in Walmart leaving out with these big TVs. Okay. Like 65 inch, 55 inch. I'm like, why is all these people got like two TVs in their carts? Like, what is what's going on? So I come to find out that the TVs is on sale. Hello. Why ain't nobody tell a girl? So the 55 inch is 128. And what is it? The 55 inch is like 128 or something like that. And the 65 inch is 228. Um, yes. That's mine right there behind me. I didn't even get the toilet paper yet. And on top of that, I don't even have my truck to bring it home, okay? I drove my daughter's car and she got a little Chevy Cruze. Now, my big ass truck is at home in the garage. I had to call my daughter and her and her boyfriend gonna come and pick the TV up for me real quick. Um, the cool thing about this is I wanted a big ass, big, big, big TV for the longest. Like, it's a 65 inch. What do I have in my living room? I think it's like a 45, 50, something like that. It's not big enough because I can't see it, okay? I mean, I can see it, but if it's $200, I'm buying it. So the TV was really too... The TV was really 228. I have to come back and get the toilet paper because I couldn't pass up this deal. But I just wanted the TV. I didn't even need another TV, but I wanted the TV. You know how you can tie your own shoes. Why do you keep playing with me? You already tied it. Stop playing with me. So we just waiting in Walmart because the lady won't even let me bring the TV outside. She thinks somebody's gonna beat me up for the TV. Like, if you want a TV that bad, then take it. I'm not about to fight you for the TV. Shit, I'll just get another one that I won't be paying for. Cause I done got beat up in the Walmart parking lot if you really want to see that bad. But yeah, so we just waiting for Tati and her boyfriend to get here. Yeah, me and Tinky just came. Right, we just came from the post office. Yeah, me and a lollipop. Is it good? Where's my lollipop comes again? What's this flavor? Mm -hmm. Citrus, citrus, citrus lime. Citrus. I like citrus lime. Lemon and lime. lime. Mm. Good. Lemon lime. Who gave that to you? Mr. Jeremy. Oh, Mr. Jeremy has who gave that to you? Mm -hmm. In the closet. Oh, uh, it was in Mr. Jeremy's closet. All the snacks was in there? Mm -hmm. Wow. No, the candy and the chocolate. Oh, that's a sucker. He asked me why do people call it that. I said that's just what some people call it. But we're here at the post office, and I got a package. But it's all broken up. The boxes. Guess who else is here in the car? You know, I never leave home without it. It's like a yeah. trash box. Pancake, say hi. What you doing in school today? Yeah. Yeah. I had a piece of yogurt. Oh, for real? You did? Yeah, I, I had a pink yogurt. A pink? Oh, like a strawberry flavor? Yeah. A pink yogurt. Yeah, was it good? Yeah. You don't even like yogurt like that anymore. Do you like it now? And what else did you do? Oh, that's interesting. What did you learn? Did you do some work? I don't know. How you gonna not know? You've been here all day. What you eat for lunch? I don't remember. How do you not remember what you ate, but you know you ate? Guess what I ate for lunch today? What? A Popeye chicken sandwich. Look who we 
see, look who we see at Fry's, or I run into at Fry's. Guess who's across the street at the tattoo shop getting her tattoo right here? What they want, tell them I'm gonna knock them out. Oh, no. You already in my vlog. Remember we was vlogging it on Walmart? Hi, JJ. Look who we see. Look who I run into. Come on, see. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. Right, Julian? Julian. Get, no. Julian. Get out of my way, JJ, before I knock you out. You just, it's gonna be when grandmothers attack. All right? No. For real. No. Julian. Julian. What is he even talking about? Julian, what is he talking about? Oh my God, what's wrong with him? What's wrong with you? Nothing. So how come you on camera? They, they can't see me. They can now. He's a cutie patootie. <laughs> Look at my baby. She's a bum. Not, not this one. No, not you the bum. This oh. is the bum. Hugged up. Booed up with raccoonie. They got a new tattoo today, right, Nay? You bought me? Yes, I am. Say hi, Nay. Hi, Nay. Didn't you get a new tattoo? Yes, I did. Take a look, guys. Brand new, first tat. She oh, didn't yeah, want to first... come along with me. It's coat. Look at It's a girl transforming into a flower, into a lovely rose lady, like a very elegant lady. Yep. Yes. She you is fat the, belly. She's. <laughs> Why'd you be like that? She's trying to insult me and my weight on camera. You know, you got Public no belly. Can't humiliate me. Love that chicken for my fans. Y'all know what that is. Popeye. Because listen, this is the Thursday in a row that I had a chicken sandwich. I never had none of those chicken sandwiches. Like, I wasn't about to stand outside and fight nobody or beat nobody up or kill nobody or get beat up myself or stand in the line for 10 hours for some chicken sandwich. I said they was probably putting crack in them chicken sandwiches the way people were acting. But I finally got one three days ago. I'm so happy. Like, I mean, not really happy. Anyway, I just, okay, look, it tastes really good. Huh? What'd you say? I am not feeding for that chicken sandwich, like, heck no. But, okay, so I did have one today. Okay, so I had two, all right, today. I mean, because if you want to drive to the store and pick it up, you might as well just get more than one for yourself, because that, like, defeats the purpose. If I, Because I, I didn't get no fries, like, okay, you know, if I went, if I drove two miles to get some chicken sandwiches, why would I only get one? What sense would that make? So I got two, and I got two yesterday, but I only had one of them yesterday. Okay, and I bought my daughter some chicken sandwiches too, but I shared one with my son, so I gave him one of mine. And the day before that, I had just one. So in total, I've had four. And I'm not gonna keep buying those chicken sandwiches. Like they're they're good, but they're not like oh my god. So I'm making my own chicken. Love that chicken for my fans. Who wanna come over and get a chicken sandwich? They're not three ninety nine though. My chicken sandwiches are going to be five dollars and sixty nine cents. Oh no, that don't sound too cool. Sixty nine. They're not gonna be free. They can who's gonna you can earn a you can I can earn a wait, they're no. gonna pay me with a wig for a chicken sandwich? No, you can buy it with some candy and get a free wig. Oh hell no. Okay, so if I'm paying if I'm charging five dollars and some change for my chicken sandwiches, they are what kind of wig they getting for me for free? A headband wig. <laughs> they're not getting that. My chicken sandwiches are worth more than Popeyes because I made them with love. Love that chicken from my fan. What'd you say? Love that chicken from my fan. Who, me? Oh, yeah, you've been seeing, she been seeing the chicken from Popeye's ads keep popping up on Snapchat and stuff. Yeah, I think the government be listening too, but you know what you gotta do? But, but You know what happens? What you should do when that happens? When that happens, you should just be like, Love that chicken from my fan. You guys wanna see my chicken? I know you guys. For muffins, look at that. Look at that chicken, okay? Love that chicken for muffins. Woo! And I don't want to fry it too hard, you guys, because, oh shit, hold up. You know, I, I'm trying to get it crisp, like juicy. Well, my chicken is always juicy. What am I talking about? But I don't want it to be all dried out, because it can't be dry like the chicken. Like, because Popeye's chicken ain't dry, so. What a new TV the other day, guys. Y'all know that I was at Walmart with my grandson. It looks really nice. Like, seriously, it's a nice TV for the price. The real price was $600, but I got it on sale for $228, so you can't beat that. And it gives a nice picture. Let me show you. So that's the TV right there. That's the picture. Now, first of all, you guys, I was so tight. I didn't realize that the TV stand that I had was not big enough. So it is the TV stand. But as you guys see, that that um, marble top, what I had to do is I had to come home, and I had to see this. I had to build something for the TV stand. I had measured the TV from the dimensions of the box. 
And I knew that I needed like just three inches on each side of extraness for the TV. You know, I'm thinking that the TV has the middle base only. Now they make these TVs with the feet, which means, you know, it takes up more space on a, the TV stand, which I hate. I like this, the base in the, you know, just the base in the middle. It's good for the TV. So I went to Home Depot. I got two nice pieces of thick wood. And I also had this contact paper already at home. So I used that, but I also got the border trim for the walls. I got two of those, sawed it down myself, and then I spray painted it silver because the knobs are silver and just put it right on top of the TV stand. So you can't even tell, like, it looks like it's part of the TV. I'm busy. Oh my God, with the flash. Stop, you might get a booger. Nate's got two piercings in her nose. Let me get it repierced. Show it off, Nate. Nate's also got freckles like her mother. Say hi, Nay. What's up, you guys? Good morning, good day, good afternoon, wherever you're at. Good evening, you know? Even in a vlog. <laughs> I got to do these. So I'm getting ready because my grandson is on his way. Well, all three of them are. Tinky's not here. Tinky's at school. Like, it's not really school, but it's school kind of like. My son and his wife, they're taking their two sons, JJ and Julian, to the zoo. So they asked my mom if she would watch the baby. Like, you know, babies are so cute. They're so sweet. You know, they don't do nothing wrong. I'm so excited about that. Right, Pancake? Yeah, everyone. You better stop drooling on my couch, okay? You got your little towel right here, and you got little drool spots on my couch. What's up? Ooh. Let's say hi, everybody. Yeah. Say hi everybody. There you go. Say hi. Hey everybody. I'm drooling on mommy's couch. Yeah. Pancakes are coming. So we're going to straighten up real quick. Right? Right? Here we are. We're going to straighten up. Yes, we are. We're going to straighten up. We're going to straighten up real quick before the baby gets here. And then I'll see you guys. 